Hello everyone, Dominic St. Charles. I'm here at Winter NAM 2017 uh, in the Anaheim, California Convention Center. Currently at the Two Old Hippies uh, booth here. Uh, we're down in hall number E, booth number 1701. And I'm here today to talk to you about a beautiful instrument that um, as an endorsed breed love artist, I am proud to be part of what they call now their uh, new for 2017, their stage series. And this one is basically their, their stage uh, studio. And as you look at it in here, it's their concert body. Um, the difference between the types of guitars that you're gonna have is that you'll have like, the, the concert is like a little bit of a smaller, whereas orchestral will have a little bit more of a, a bottom end to her and kind of gives you a little bit more of a deep end. What I tend to like about concerts is being an Irish tenor uh, with some of the performances I've done with groups like Urn, um, it tends to match uh, my voice tone a lot. And one of the things that's really, that I was drawn to breed love, uh, particularly some of their other companies such as Bedell, is uh, they're basically how they are really at the forefront of tone woods. And what's unique about this particular model is, is that you've got basically four different woods that are involved in the making of this guitar primarily. Now, a lot of your standard acoustic guitars are gonna be a, a kind of what we call uh, like a spruce top. Uh, they can range from anything from like an Engelmann spruce top to a Sitka spruce top. This one in particular happens to be Sitka. So what it is, it gets you a real nice high type sound. So then when you're playing a chord, it gives you that nice brightness. And the other thing that's also kind of amazing about the kind of it is, is the tone woods on it. And on this one in particular, it is made out of coco bolo, which is a very beautiful and very exquisite wood. Um, it's very heavy, very dense wood. So it gives you, in the case of playing an instrument, will give you a lot of deeper tones, bass tones, mid-range tones. And uh, when a guitar tends to reverberate, so when you play an acoustic guitar, you have like all these like X bracings, which kind of gives you like the reverberation of the guitar. And what it does is um, it kind of bounces off the back of this and then it comes out the sound hole. So the different types of woods that you have are gonna give you a kind of different type of tonality. Uh, so if you have like a sapelli or kind of like an Indian rosewood, or if you have a couple of other different ones like that, you're gonna get different types of tones. So really what you wanna do is mix, mix and match different types of tones depending if you're a singer or songwriter or if you're doing recordings and things like this. So the reason why I like Coco Bolo, um, it's, like I said, it's a thick wood. Like for example, this is a wood that will not float. It'll sink to the bottom of any creek or lake or something like that. You can make a boat out of it, but don't think you're getting anywhere if you make a raft out of it. Because it's a very, very, very dense wood as opposed to say like a maple. And so, so when you play it, you get real, real nice, you know, tone. And then the projection really comes out, so it really just has a nice, you don't really need to, like if you put like a, a SM57 mic on it, it's really gonna capture a lot of things very well. And uh, like I said, um, you know, obviously we're grateful to SIT strings, which is what I have on this guitar. Um, you can find them, you know, part of, uh, on, from Akron, Ohio. And they're upstairs, I think, at booth number 3732. And like I said, if you play with like a, a pick or if you're a finger pick or something like that, the one thing that I really like about uh, Breedlove and, and any of the brands from Tool Hippies is that they really do a fantastic job of the action. Now, for those of you who aren't familiar with action is, that's the height of the strings off the top of the fretboard. And uh, sometimes a lot of people tend to like lower action uh, because it doesn't hurt as much when you're depressing on the strings, but uh, a lot of like, flat pickers or country pickers or bluegrass pickers that tend to use a lot of fingers, they tend to like the action a little bit higher so that they can, you know, get like the nice appreggios going when they're playing the guitar. So really, it's your preference, but that's the nice thing about it. Um, like I said, you can always visit Breedlove, you know, breedloveguitars.com. 
and uh, they have a wonderful interactive website and they have a section dedicated to different types of tone woods. So whether if you're looking at like an Honduran mahogany or if you're looking for Indian rosewood or something beautiful like a Hawaiian koa, uh, you can educate yourself on the different types of woods and they also go into like a nice video section on how the guitars are actually made. And so if you're in the market to buy a new guitar, um, this would definitely be a good way to go. Um, Larry Breedlove was the master luthier at Taylor Guitars for a number of years when he formed uh, his own guitar company, Breedlove, back in 1990. And uh, the craftsmanship that goes into these instruments are just beyond exquisite and second to none. So, like I said, this one here is uh, brand new for 2017. It's their uh, Exotic Stage Series. Uh, again, you can go to breedloveguitars.com and you can check out a lot of the stuff that they do. Um, as for myself, Dominic St. Charles with the band Earn, our flagship website is www.earncentral.urncentral. Uh, we're currently uh, wrapping up our touring for our Epiphany album, and we're going to be uh, working on a new album called Semicolon, uh, probably in about June or July of this year. So uh, we've been basically playing all around Los Angeles uh, in a lot of the markets. Today we'll be at the world famous Doll Hut as part of their NAM celebration, and we're looking forward to that. So if you have any, you know, we're always also interactive on social media. So like I said, just a, a very beautiful guitar, you know. So if you get a chance, you know, if you're here uh, in Anaheim and you want to come to the NAM section, again, Two Old Hippies is the parent company. They're booth 1701 in Hall E. And you can talk to Sammy Mulhern and any of the wonderful staff here and they'll be more than happy to give you a hand on that. Thank you very much for your time. So for Sonic State Magazine, this is Dominic St. Charles of Vernon saying thank you for your time.